All right, so all of these players in this team are going to be at a new club in Ultimate Team next year. So it's going to be interesting. Let's see what we can do with them this year. If you guys want safe, cheap, and reliable FIFA 19 coins with 24-7 support and also 100% safe comfort trades, make sure you head over to MuleFactory.com and also use the code NERDFIRE at the checkout to get yourself a cheeky 5% off any order you make on the site. Also, just before we get into the video, if you guys want to go ahead and get yourself some G Fuel, make sure you head over to the G Fuel website, a link in the description to that, and go ahead and use the code NERD at the checkout for 10% off your order. All right, boys, so we are back with a brand new video, and as you can tell by the title, we are using a fully transferred team in a game of Foot Champions. So today, yeah, we're going to go ahead and build a team of players that have all transferred. Sadly, we can't actually all use their transfer cards because not all of them have actual transfer cards in the game. So only the ones that have been transferred that we can fit into the team will be used as in if they've got a transfer card They'll be in the team instead. So yeah, basically we're making a team out of players that have been transferred through the summer transfer window And it should be interesting in terms of the summer transfer window um, It was decent to start for my team Man United, but we're not going to talk about the rest I don't want to see anything like that in the comments, please. I beg it was already painful enough experience in it. I'm not going to lie. However, some of the biggest transfers of the window we've had so far, obviously it's still open for foreign countries. Not in England though, but we had the likes obviously of Eden Hazard moving from Chelsea to Real Madrid, and that's pretty much been the biggest one. I'm not going to lie. I mean, we've obviously had Harry Maguire, world record free of a defender coming from Leicester to Manchester United. My team that I support, which is fairly decent. And some other good transfers. But yeah, anyways, what we're going to do is we're going to head straight over to FIFA. We're going to get ourselves a team made, and then we're going to get ourselves into a game of foot champions with it and see what we can do with a fully transferred team. So yeah, boys, with Without further ado, let's get ourselves into that now and let's see what team we can come up with. Alright boys, so now we're going into squad. Let's go ahead and create ourselves a new squad. We're going to call it Transfer Team, like so. So there we go, that's done. Now it's time to figure out what players we can use in this team. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to figure out who's actually got a transfer card. And if there's enough to make a team, a full team out of it, we'll do that. But if not, we'll just use players as well that have been transferred that haven't got their card yet on FIFA, but we can use in the team. We probably will go that route. We probably just use any player that has been transferred and even if they're still at their old club on the game. Let's do it. So we've got the likes of Eden Hazard. I know that. Uh, where are you at, my boy? I've got the footies Eden Hazard, so that is perfecto. Neto has got a card. Has he got an actual normal card, though? Is it a loan? Because I don't think I got his loan. Let's have a look. Is this actually going to be a normal card? No. Okay. That's kind of awkward. And I don't actually have Griezmann done either. So, yeah. All right. We might just have to buy Neto's old card and just use that. All right. So, we're definitely not going to be able to use just transfer players. So, if we use the normal Neto here. And now I've actually got an idea of who could be our centre-back partnership. Which could be very, very nice. But which one's this? Neto here. Concert players. We'll have to use then his Valencia version. Then, at the back, we're going to have the boys. Ed uh, Militao, who's obviously moved to Real Madrid. Like so. And then we're going to have flashback David Luiz. Who obviously made a transfer to Arsenal. As you can see, like so, as our middle three at the back. All right, so obviously we haven't really even figured a formation because we're in the 4-4-2 right now. I'm probably going to go with the 4-3-3. That's always a formation that I seem to go with for these teams. So 4-3-3, we might go with like so. Obviously, like I said, we're going to use Hazard in here so he can go up top. Griezmann obviously has that footies card, but I don't actually have it. So we'll have to go, I suppose, with his normal base 89 rated Atletico Madrid card, which I have a loan one of, which means that I have to spend coins. I love that. All right, so we've also got the likes of Aaron Wambasaka, who can go on the right back. I used to have his card, but we can just pick up his team of the season, maybe, if I can afford it. I literally have like 100k right now, I'm not going to lie, so hopefully we can get him. So, centre mid, we have the likes of Rodri, who we could use. I don't have his team of the season anymore, because that was actually an objective, I'm pretty sure. But we could use him. We've got the likes of then Endombele as well. Um, okay, where you at? End on Bele. Uh, we could possibly pick up your team this season if we can afford it. Like I said, I'm really poor right now. Actually, if we put End on Bele down here, then Nicola Pepe on the wing, once again... I literally have no coins. We'll probably sell someone to be able to afford some of these players. Just for you guys. Just for the video. Chemistry's not the strongest right now, though. I'm not going to lie about it. Uh, we could do with improving that. Oh, so apparently, you can actually get the team of the season, Rodri, now. All right, so we can actually use ourselves the Ferland Mendy, who obviously moved to Real Madrid as well. Like so, at the right, uh, sorry, the left back, which then gives us a nice link to end on Bele, which is beautiful. So, we pretty much just need one more central centre mid that can hopefully get us a bit of chemistry. I mean, I don't really know if there is anyone. I can't lie, I'm trying to think right now. So, we could put Thiago Mendes in here, we'll get a strong link there with Pepe. I mean, chemistry still isn't the best. It'd be nice if we had a Brazilian from the La Liga that we could put in centre mid, but I can't really think of any now. I mean, last year, obviously, Artur, but not now. I mean, Rodri gets obviously a link with Griezmann, but still... 
Uh, not the best of chemistry. All right, so flicking through formations. If we went to this formation, then we could bring in Nabil Fekir, like so. So Fekir in here, because obviously he moves to Real Betis, but we can then use his old version at, um, obviously, Leon, because he moved to Betis, and then he gets a French link to both Griezmann and Dombele, and obviously gets a link to Thiago Mendes, who's also in the league one as well, and that probably gets us the best chemistry we could probably get with this team. All right then, boys, so we've now changed back to the 4-3-3 bracket free formation as well because it gets us a little bit more chemistry. So as you can see here, this is the team we're going to go with. I'm going to have to sell someone, I think, to be able to afford the best variants of these cards. But if not, we're going to have to downgrade some of the cards to lower versions and work with that. But I'm sure we'll be able to sort this out. It'll be all right. All right, so we can use Juan Basaka, but for chemistry, we could actually go in our right back role, Danilo. So, you know, he could definitely be an option as well. Or we could switch him out and we could actually bring in Danny Alves instead. But I do not have his flashback, sadly. So we'd have to use his normal card. So we would have to use his normal card like so. But it probably would be better just for the chemistry. So we'll go with him instead. Even though I wanted to use Juan Masaka as he was a Man United chancellor. But, you know, never mind. All right, then, boys. So I think we have come up with a team that we're going to use. So in goal, we have Neto, who moved to Barcelona. Right back, we have Danny Alves, who moved to Sao Paulo. Or how do you pronounce it? Sao Paulo? I can't even remember. Sao Paulo. Yes. We'll go with that if I've got it wrong. Ignore me. Right centre back, we have David Luiz who moved to Arsenal. Left centre back, we have Edda Militao who uh, sorry moved to Real Madrid. Left back, we have Ferlan Mendy who uh, moved sorry to Real Madrid as well. Left defensive midfield, we have Endon Bele who moved to Spurs. Central centre mid, we have Nabil Fekir who moves to Real Betis. Right defensive midfield, we have Thiago Mendes who moves to Leon. Right wing, we have Nicola Pepe who moved to Arsenal. Striker, we have Griezmann who obviously moved to Barcelona. And left wing, we have the only transfer card that we actually have in the team, and that is the footies Eden Hazard who moved obviously from Chelsea to Real Madrid. So that's our starting 11. I'm going to get three subs on the bench as well, out of choice. And um, hopefully they can make an impact off the bench. We'll see. Might have to throw some uh, Man United players in there as there's none literally in this team. And I'm a Man United fan, so it has to happen. So yeah, when I've done that, I'll be back with you guys with the three subs of choice. And you can see who we use. Okay then, boys. So we've gone ahead and bought the whole team. But like I said, I was going to show you guys the bench first. The three players that we are using on the bench. So our bench consists of flashback Wayne Rooney. Obviously, Rooney has gone to uh, Derby. Well, in January, at least, he's going to Derby. Then we've got Harry Maguire, went to Manchester United. And we've got Adrissa Garnagay, who's gone to PSG. All right, so there we go. Now the whole team is bought. As you can see on the screen, we've got all the players bought. I went for the Nicola Pepe um, headliners. I know I'm a cheapskate. I keep skating my way out of it. But it is what it is, you know. At least we still got a team. So what I'm going to do with the rest of the bench is fill it up with bronze players. Then we're going to get ourselves into a game of foot champions. So without further ado, let's get into that now. And let's see what the transfer team can do. All right, boys. So we have found ourselves an opponent. Let's see what team he's rocking out as well. His team is loading in three, two, one. Bang. Okay. All right. So he's got Eusebio, Cruyff, Havertz, Milinkovic, Savage, Vieira, Pog, but yeah, okay, that's a very nice team. I'm not gonna lie. That is a very nice team. We probably got all them icons from the icon SBC as well. Wouldn't surprise me. But yes, we'll see what we can do against the team with the fully transferred team in the foot champions. Now let's get into it and let's see what we can do. Alright, boys, here we go. Kickoff time. No, no, no. Oh my days. Uh okay. Well, he's winning 1-0. Alright, that's a good start, isn't it? That's a really good start. Brilliant. Alright, so we're 1-0 down. Let's just continue and hope we can do better. One, two. Love that. Griezmann make a run. Hazard make a run. Hazard. Oh, you're off again. What are you doing? Sort yourself out, Hazard. Well played, lad. And again. Nice. I still have the ball. I still have the ball, ref. What are you doing? All right, then, boys. So there we go. Half time. It is 1 0 to this guy. I mean, this guy obviously has the better team, and our players just don't seem to be up par right now. We apparently haven't even had a shot. So, uh, <laughs> that's fun. We're going to have to make some subs. Let's see what we can do in the second half. Bring Rooney on, and hopefully he can make an impact. All right. So, in terms of subs, Rooney is going to come on. Um, I think I'm going to put Militao, the um, CDM, and then we're going to bring Maguire on at centre back because why not? I mean, we're already losing, so it can't get worse. Maguire in centre back, Rooney at striker. Let's see what we can do. Okay. The second half starts. Let's do this. Oh my god, I've completely lost there. Oh, is, is it just... Oh, yeah, just, he's offside, surely. That was offside. Now you're lying. You're actually lying. What? I swear that was offside. Okay, 2-0 down. Let's just continue. Now to Eden Hazard. Can he actually do something? A 97 rated Eden Hazard. Can he do something here? Lacro that. Lacro that again? No? Okay, apparently not. Of course not. Why did I think Eden Hazard could do something? Militao? Hazard? 
Hazard! Oh, there we go! When we actually need him to fully step up, he gets us a goal. It is now 2-1. That was a nice finish. Nice bit of play, and Hazard gets the finish. As you can see here, lovely finish into that top right corner. I'll take that. Let's go, and let's get another one back. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, he's going to score. Is that, uh, he actually just did. Of course he did. I've got, I love FIFA 19. <laughs> love this game. Yeah, cheers. We need you to step up again. Oh, my. Okay, play this in again to Rooney. Now to Fekir. Turn this. Rooney, let's go. Okay, we've pulled another one back. A lovely bit of play there. Wayne Rooney with the finish. It is now 3-2. Can we pull another one back, get the equaliser, and then somehow win? I don't know, but I'll take that goal. Big Harry Maguire. You've got to follow Havertz. And he has, but he's... No, no, no. Yeah. Okay, yep, it's all over. I think it's all over. It is now. All right, can we do anything from the corner? Hazard to you. Drag back. Lacro. Penalty! We'll have the penalty. I mean, I don't think we're going to be able to do anything after this if we score it, but I'll take the penalty. All right, so on the penalty is going to be Wayne Rooney. Come on, Waza. You got this. Wayne Rooney gets the finish. Come on, let's just skip it. Can we get another goal? This is actually don't tell me you're going to waste time in August. He's actually wasting time in August. Yeah, he he's wasting time in August. He is wasting time in August. We are witnessing this right now of someone wasting time in foot champions in August. Oh dear, you are what I call a sad act, my friend. That is what you are. You are wasting time in August. Well, there we go. We had an absolute sad act. Clearly playing that game, wasting time in a game of foot champions in August against the team I had. You love to see it, boys. You just love to see an absolute sweat like that in August. But yes, that does wrap up the game. So let me just show you confirmation of the score. So there's the confirmation of the score. He did win 4-3. And then if we take a look at the overall stats, as you can see, he did definitely dominate me. I mean, he definitely had a better team and he did definitely dominate as well. Six shots to my 17. Sorry, I had six shots to his 17. Five on target to his 10. He had 55% possession. And yeah, that's pretty much the uh, summary of the game. But there we go. That wraps up the game with the... The transfer team or the fully transfer team in foot champions it definitely could have gone worse i mean i don't think we did too bad considering the team we had and the team he had so i suppose i will take it all right boys so that does wrap up today's video sadly we did manage to lose it was quite annoying i'm not gonna lie but it is what it is i mean that's just what happens i mean the team wasn't the best i probably should have gone for the team with season pepe and sold someone else to get him but i didn't because I was being stingy. However, it's still fun to use a transfer team. So what I want you guys to do in today's video is let me know in the comments who you think is the best steal of the transfer window that has been so far. Obviously, like I said, the um, foreign transfer window is still open. But from the window that was in the English window, let me know who you think was the best transfer, who got the best deal in the transfer market in real life, obviously, as well. But yeah, guys, anyways, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.